Hey and welcome back to 16 Years in Alkin 3. Finally booked in, uh, I've taken my stuff upstairs, I've had a little bit of a walk through. Um, but yeah, let's have a look through uh, what we're going through. Uh, going through, sir? Yeah, that's good. Cool. Uh, with your card. <laughs> I'm not letting, it, letting an imposter come through, am I? Yeah, that's good. Cool. Um, people are just looking in, so there's lots of people coming through here. Um, it's a little bit tight on the insides, but you know, for a new hostel, it's alright actually. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm up on the top floor. Uh, maybe they just want to keep me out of the way, I don't know, sort of thing. Uh, yeah, but it's a, it's a brilliant little place. Uh, already met some friendly people. Uh, old guy down there on his motorbike, he was absolutely friendly, had a brilliant chat with him, you know, while the hours away. Um, yeah, uh, some younger folk that come down from Durham. Beautiful city Durham is. Uh, right, I'm going to go through this way. Yeah, so it's uh, a lot more uh, like a, an old church, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, quite good. Uh, something about Elizabeth. I'll let you go through, sir. Uh, yeah, Elizabeth uh, and Neville. I think that's the person I was saying that was buried up the, uh, up the way. Actually, uh, second wife over there. So Charles Strickland. Elizabeth was an inspiration for the building of the North Block. I think that's what we're in now. Uh, I think that gentleman's in the same uh, building as I am. So should be uh, quite interesting. But yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a good old place, this. Uh, I'll do this one and then I'll do another one afterwards to show you around the rest of it. But I just thought I'll show you around uh, my uh, bedroom for the night. I didn't realise they had numbers on them. I don't think they do, do they? I don't think so. Oh, that's fair play. I just, you know, jumped in, chopped my stuff on one. It was uh, the way it went. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, here's uh, the bedroom. We're in the shared room tonight. Uh, double uh, bunk bed, bunk beds, bunk beds. Uh, nice sink on the outside of there. And then we've got a nice uh, shower room here. Uh, I'm not too sure where the light is on this. Oh, it comes on automatically. But it's a normal, what I call an Italian shower, you know, floor. The only difference is there's no toilet in the same shower. Anybody that's been to Italy, you'll know what I mean. Uh, yeah, I've been trying that out later. That's for damn sure. Nice squeegee there to squeegee everything up. And then, look at this bathroom. Nice sink, mirror, toilet, open window. Everybody knows that I'm going to be in here tonight. <laughs> Yeah, from you, uh, open window. Uh, yeah, you've got a lot of coat hooks on the back so you can hang stuff up there. Another mirror, just in case uh, everybody, well, is a bit of a, a fashionista, shall we say. Uh, right, I'll tell you what, because we've got a gentleman setting himself in, we're going for a tour around the other side. There is uh, stairs there. I'm not too sure where they need to, so I'm just going to go back the way I came. But yeah, it's not bad, £16. Got, I've got a bed for the night. I was hoping for some uh, laundrette services. Excuse me, uh, laundrette services, but they haven't got that, so uh, that's one thing. But they did say that I could use a, a Hoover later. So it might be later, it might be in the morning, not too sure about that. Uh, I'm keeping my card out because uh, a lot of the places you have to use your card just to get into uh, them certain areas. Well, it saves anybody else from walking in the street. Uh, another happy thing is, I think they locked the gates up there. The only other thing is, I went to take a picture of my uh, of William in front of uh, their museum, and that was a definite no. <laughs> definite no no for that one. But yeah, we carry on down. Uh, more rooms on this level. I thought it was, um, you know, one level was for girls, one level was for, uh, for boys, males, females, whatever well, no, you want to call it. More gender fluid these days, so I'm not too sure. But. We'll come down here. Uh, no, I don't need my car from that one. Oh, no, this is bathrooms. It says bathrooms on it. It says we're right for looking at my phone and not the thing. Right, TV lounge area. Come in here. Nobody's in here. So, yeah, I'm going to be in here later with the uh, laptop um, because I'm using up all the uh, memory on my phone. So I've got to download someone to the laptop so I have some more memory on there rather than just deleting things. Uh, what have we got here? Oh, it's an aerial, one for all. I think that might be uh, the uh, Wi-Fi. I'm not 100% sure on that. Right, one of the things I was looking for, plug socket. 
I have a laptop and we've got some massive TV even bigger than the one I've got at home and we've got lots of child DVDs from things like Mirror Mirror Looney Tunes what else are the other things uh, Wonder oh god we're not even going to say that one I'm sure that I start making references to it uh, I've got that door that, I've got three doors <sighs> Let's pick it, we'll go through this door. Let's see what this door's doing. Right, where does this door, oh, it moves into a cubby hole. And then next door, oh, it's another, oh, it's another front room with a porch. Oh, yes, well, another conservatory. Got a nice map there. Are there any plug sockets out here? Uh, no, no plug sockets out here. Oh, yes, there is one, but that's going to be leading across the floor. So one over that side. Not too sure, but a lovely garden out there, look. Wow. Yes, I think I might be uh, enjoying myself out there a bit later. That's for damn sure. But there's plenty of plug sockets in here. Gentlemen, uh, write these journals down there. So, I'm coming through that door, so let's try this door. And this door is a game room. Uh, recycling. So I might do some recycling. And some foosball whatever else you want to call it and then we come back through here ah oh, this is back to the i think this is where the other stairway comes down from and uh, you've got reception out there tv lounge back in there so let's go through this way uh we've got the trolley room i think that's the room i might have oh let's get it again really ah this is just a a big old dining room I might actually come in here and do my uh, computer work that I need to do, to be honest. Uh, you can't climb a mountain on an empty stomach. Good logo, that is. I tried it, and believe me, you can't. Uh, and then we come down to it's self-catering. Right, uh, self-catering, yes. Uh, it's just a, a dining room. People's food's already out there. I thought this was the kitchen, so uh, two seconds. Let's try and another self catering. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, yes, this is what I was looking for. A kitchen. I haven't got cooking William. Not that I mind cooking in William, don't tell him that. Uh, yeah, I, I don't mind that, but it's going to be nice having a kitchen. And I didn't realise you can walk through from one self catering to the next self catering. So, you know, I can't really argue with that, can I? Oh, here's a little uh, fishing. Painting, photo, print, up here, microwaves. Don't think I'm going to be using that. Uh, and then we come out, uh, that's to the outside door. There's a dive fire door. Ah, that's the other stairs. So when I come down later, I'm going to be using that one. Oh, you know, uh, staff only. And then, uh, dry luggage room. Oh my word. When me and, well, every time I've done the West Island Way, and even when me and Lee have done the West Island Way, when it's been raining and whatnot, you just cannot miss a dry room. And how good is this dry room? Hmm, it's not too bad, it's quite big actually. All right. Some more plug sockets, somewhere to hang on. Uh, I think that might. No mittens, authorised, personal only. Right, so I can't go up there, but yeah. It's a definitely a dry room in here. Uh, and then, yeah, you can come out and if you've got megabuts, which I won't show you through there because there's children through there. But, yeah, you've got all your amenities here. You know, everything through a kitchen, somewhere to stay, a nice garden, uh, a bed. You know, it might be a bunk bed, but it's a bed. So, yeah, can't argue that for £16. Right, I'm going to grab the laptop out of William uh, and download a lot of things. I'm going to have some ramen noodles. Or shall I go for, I might go for the cashew noodles actually, just to, you know, make a difference. Well, it's not a difference, but you, you know what I mean. But other than that, guys, uh, I think that's me for tonight, unless uh, a lot of the people that I've met up with want to go on video and we can have a chat then. But other than that, guys, like I always say, take it easy, keep adventuring, and love you, bye.